Hello, it's Sean from Tested. Happy holidays. I am here with my end of the year favorite things. Um, I found some very cool items this year and would like to share. So, the very th first thing on the uh, list is this uh, camping stove. During our, our, our Honda camping event, I didn't get to show this off and I was so excited about it. We, we helped to cook ribs and stuff on it and it is a 10,000 BTU stove that will boil 32 ounces of water in three minutes. Uh, it runs off of propane tanks and has built-in piezoelectric lighters and it's far quieter than most other stoves that I've had. Uh, this is not a backpacking stove, obviously. It's a little hefty, but if you're doing some nice car camping and you have the money to spend, uh, the Jetboil Genesis is definitely, definitely worth checking out. Along those lines, also what I used during camping a lot was my finalized pocket carry. I've been working on... Uh, you know, we talk about this a lot on Tested, and I've been working on gathering mine and perfecting it, and this is the year. I have the uh, Leatherman PS4 Squirt, uh, and it folds up nice and small, fits in, the, in your watch pocket, and it has the pliers on it. So this is the pliers version, not the wire stripper one, which I highly recommend. I also have the Fenix e E05 flashlight, light, which is awesome. It's super bright, has three settings, and runs off of a, a AAA forever. And I finally got my Fisher Space Pen, which also nicely fits in my watch pocket. So all of these little guys get tucked away and are with me all the time. Along those lines, keeping things small and portable, I this is a Kickstarter that I had supported a few years ago. It is the Fin6 Dart, which is meant to take the place of your big bulky laptop brick. So it is a very small wall charger. This weighs half as much or less than my brick. It's obviously a lot smaller. It has a removable, reversible cable, and it comes with an array of nine different tips to fit almost any laptop. Uh, it will provide 65 watts of power, and it will currently work with anything other than Macs and the Surface. Uh, and it even has an integrated USB port so that it doesn't eat up one on your uh, laptop, and I can also use this as a standalone phone charger uh, just by plugging into that. So I, I really like this guy. It has really lightened my load. Moving along, we're getting into some actual toys. I discovered the Bandai Snap Together Star Wars kits this year. They are amazing. They are the most detailed model kits that I have ever seen. The the attention to detail and the amount of detail on these is great. Uh, they also did some crazy multicolor sprue printing. So you can actually put this together as is and it looks really nice. Uh, so you don't, if you're not like really in the modeling, you don't have to get into the painting. Uh, and it even came with, this is what really blew me away. It comes with either the regular peel and stick stickers or the water slide decals. So depending on what your commitment level is. Um, and these have been great. I've picked up a few of these. They have all the different ships and they're very reasonably priced. And finally, to go along with that, I've discovered this series of modeling books, the single model books by Rinaldi Studios. Um, these are by Michael Rinaldi, a professional modeler. And what he has done is each book is dedicated to one model kit from different companies. This is one of our favorites, it's the Fish Sub from uh, Industria Mechanica, which we have featured here on Tessa before. And it basically walks you through how the paint, detail, uh, weather, and everything, and it's not only showing you how to do it, but it's explaining why you do it this way. These books are fantastic, and they're good for beginners or advanced people who just wanna learn some stuff. And uh, they're currently running, I think it is, if they're running a holiday sale, uh, which have these at a really good price, so check them out. It's Rinaldi Studio Press. Um, but those are my, some of my favorite things for the year. I hope that you like them, and I'd love to hear what you like. So give us some feedback in the comments. Happy holidays.